Good morning, boys and girls. I am so happy to see you. This is Miss Hubbard, and I am so happy that you are here to join our Nearpod lesson for today. Make sure you put in, you have your mom and dad put in the access code J A K T D at near join nearpod.com. You can access this on your cell phone or on your computer. Okay, I'm going to wait until you join. All right, I see Tom, I see Bob, I see Jim and Joe here in our class. I am so happy to see you. I miss you all. But for today, we're going to do our lesson here in our Nearpod. Today's lesson is going to be on mixed up words. Remember those words that we've been studying while we were gone. So we're going to talk about those words today. This is going to be an interactive lesson. So I want to remember, I want you to remember, you can use this on your cell phone or on your computer. But before we start our lesson, let's review our ABC song. Did you get all of those A, B, C, and B? Were you able to also say all of the words along with the A, B, Cs? Well, if you did not, I want you to try again. And this time, the music will be off. And I want to hear you nice and loud as you say the letter. You ready? I can't hear you. Are you ready? Oh, great. I love it. So I'm going to start the song, but I want to hear you. So you won't hear the music. You'll just see the letters. And when you see the letters, I want to hear you say each letter as it goes, as it appears on the screen. Let's ready. Let's get ready. Let's go. A. Apple, B, Balloon, 
C. Cat. D. Duck. E. Egg. F. Fish. G. Goat. H. Hat. I. Ice cream. J. Jelly. K. Kite. L. Lion. M. Monkey. N. Nest. O. I'll. P. Parrot. Q. Queen. R. Rabbit. S. Sun. T. Turtle. U. Umbrella. V. Violin. W. Well. X. Xylophone. Y. Yogurt. Z. Zebra. Okay, there you have it. We did it. We said our ABCs, and I heard each and every one of you. Again, if you want to go back and practice, I want you to play this near power one more time and play it again for yourself and practice with your mom and dad. Okay, we're going to move on from our, our warm-up and jump right into our lesson for today. But before we jump into our lesson, let's see if you remember how to write your name. But what's your name? I want you to think about what is the first letter in your name? Let me see if I have some friends who can who can write their names and I'm going to show their names uh, as they are, are as you're writing it. Oh, I see that Stanley wrote his name. He wrote an S. S for Stanley. Oh, I love it. Adam. Adam wrote an A. A for Adam. Way to go, Emma. She wrote an E for Emma. Oh, and there's Paul. He did a P for Paul. You all remember your alphabet and you remember how to write your name using your Apple alphabet letters. Great job. I am so proud of each and every one of you. And if I didn't get a chance to share your screen, it's okay. I will share it next time. Okay, for today's lesson, we are going to do a flashcard. We're going to do a flashcard exercise on some of those sight words we've been working on all month. As I say the say the the word, I want you to repeat after me cuz I'm pretty sure you remember these these sight words. No. Can you say no? No. Out. Can you say out, out, ran, I can't hear you, did you say ran, ran, very good, oh, this is a new one, ride, oh, yes, Miss Hubbard added some new words in, ride, let's try under, under, can you say under, well, well, very good. So we're just going to work on these few that we have at the top of our list. Let's move on and actually try to practice using some of those words in a sentence. No. Can you say no again? No. We have no snow. Of course, because it is now spring, so we have no snow. Can you say the word again? No. Very good. 
out. Out. Can you say that word again? Out. Yes. We went outdoors. Very good. We went outdoors. Yes, I'm sure you are going outdoors a little bit with your mom and dad. Ran. I ran in the park. Ran. Can you say that word? Ran. Ran. Very good. Ride. That's what that new word is for us today. Ride. I want to want a ride. Under, under, under the bed. Very good. Now let's try to use those same words that we just reviewed and arrange the letters to form the words by writing the letters in the correct order. Okay, so you you looking at that picture, you probably saying, oh, that picture means something there. Does it mean something important? Usually this means what? Mm, let me see if I can share someone's screen. Oh, yes. It means no. N O. So you should have wrote N and then an O next to it. That spells no. I know this looks like on, which is the word on. But this symbol, this picture, lets us know it's no. N O. Great job. Okay. And this you if you can see this picture here, it's like a little bucket of water throwing out, throwing out the water. Out. So here we go again. Well, how do we spell out? O U T. Did you write that? Did you write O U T? Okay, if you did, great job. I love that you're trying so hard and working so hard on your words. So I want to share a couple pictures of what, what my students are doing and in the classroom so we can see all the wonderful work. Okay. Awesome job, Emma. Awesome job. Okay. All right. Now, if I didn't share yours, I'm going to uh, be ready because I may be sharing yours next. Okay, we're going to go to the next one. And this is one is going to be our last one for today. Arrange the letters to again to form form the written word. And this little boy looks like he's underwater. He's he's in the water. He looks like he's diving down. He's under he's underwater. How do we spell that word? Remember it is you. You got the u and the n and a D and the E and the R. Oh, I just love how well you guys are working on your on your writing. Very good. Make sure you use your you, you write your letters correctly. All right. I'm gonna share one more screen of, of another student, and Stanley is doing a wonderful job. He is definitely you work, working on his letter formation of writing his U's correctly and his D's correctly. I love it. Great job. You all are doing the work. And I love that you're trying to spell those words out. Okay, here we go. Now, I want you to remember the, all the work that we did today. And go. let's go back over some of those key words that we talked about. And it's going to be the ones that's at, at the very top. No. Out. I can't hear you. Can you say no? No. Out, ran, ride, under, and well. So we're going to end our time by listening to our sight word, um, our sight word video. When we say dance, you dance and go crazy. A. And. Away. Big. Blue. Pear. 